here in Miami, Lone Depot Park. We've got baseball coming up for Jackie Robinson Day. It's the San Francisco Giants taking on the Miami Marlins. With my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomby. Chris, today a special day on the Major League Baseball calendar, Jackie Robinson Day. Everyone on the field. So two down, and yeah, the batter now, Willie Mays. That is her. The center fielder, Willie Mays. That one is absolutely belted. And it bangs off the out-of-town scoreboard. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. Absolutely blasted that one into the gap, but just didn't have quite enough to clear the wall out there. Maybe a little more elevation under it, and it carries over, but that's a swing you'll be happy with every time. And now let's see if they force some action with good wheels on the bases. Strike two. I love this part of the game. Does he really want to try and steal second against this catcher? I know he's fast, but it's pretty risky. Step off throw to first. Mays back on a dive. Boom, here's a guy at the plate. I'm expecting to have a good game. He always seems to play better in road games. And a pitch. To the right side. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Run around at first with one gone. Luisa Rise stands in. Left hand hitter waits. Base hit, center field. Lead runner makes the turn at second. The throw to third. And the throws offline, safe at third. As we go to the top of the fourth, here's some real power at the plate. Willie Mays. Swing and a high fly ball, deep left field. Sanchez going back on it. Pulls it in on the warning track. Now, now. Welcome back to the ballpark here on Jackie Robinson Day. Abasail Garcia up to the plate. Garcia. The wind of the pitch. Line drive, that's a base hit. He's been working out of the stretch just about the entire game, bro. One down. Now the number two hitter, Brian De La Cruz. The pitch. Laser! Base hit! Lead runner touches second, headed for third. The throw in. Into third now. So runners at the corners and one out. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride below. All set for the start of the inning. And digging in for San Francisco, Willie Mays. That one ripped. That's back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Woo! He was all. Willie Mays now at the plate. In the air, left field. Sanchez has a beat on it. Hauls it in, and there's one away. And up next for Miami, Jake Berger. Kicks and fires. Out towards right center. That's well struck. Could be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. Oh, the throw is over his head. Around second now, going for three. He's in there. So first and second with two outs. Willie Mays, the next giant to hit. Year in and year out, this guy an MVP candidate. And there's a foul ball. That breaking ball is in for a strike and quickly it is nothing at two. Two on, two outs. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Around third. He'll score, and they lead by four. It's a run on the board and picks up an RBI. Dining on the swing was good. Able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. Two outs. 
Swings and misses. Struck him out. Well, someone from the bullpen had to come in, get a big out, and then had a little time to think about it before he went back out to get the final three outs of this ball game. Nonetheless... And welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. MLB The Show with a good one coming at you. It's the San Francisco Giants taking on the Miami Marlins. Joined by my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomby. And Chris, we've got an opportunity to watch one of the true superstars of the sport. Willie Mays leads the team at OPS, so he's the guy that looks to slug and basically make things happen for them offensively. Just a machine in just about to get underway and on the mound today A.J. Puck well last year kind of around the league average in terms of ERA and you know what runner on the goal that's the third tosses to first oh. Mays retired at first that's a good piece of hitting right there the job was to move the runner base is empty with two away Luisa Rise stands in two outs and a rope in the center field base hit. Just so sound in his mechanics. Hits against a firm front side. Willie Mays, the next giant to hit. Kind of a throwback. No batting gloves. And it's fouled away. Two outs. Foul ball there. The pitch. Hit weakly on the ground. The rise. In plenty of time to first. Mays retired at first. And that. Willie Mays digs in now. He has, as they like to say. Let me guess, Boo. Light tower power. That's right. Up the middle. Off balance Out. throw in time. Mays retired. So up next, Jesus Sanchez. Line drive, base hit. He needed that one. Well, it's been a tough stretch at the plate lately. We we'll often hear the phrase short to it. Back here at Lone Depot Park. New inning getting started and digging in for San Francisco, Willie Mays. Here comes a pitch. And a foul ball. I mean, his pitch efficiency, ability to get ahead and count, at times pitch to contact, let the defense work behind him. That's why he's still in the game here in the ninth inning. Hammers that one deep left field and forget it. is 11th of the year and they're on the board it's 4-1 this game just got a little more interesting with that home run looks like this guy was looking out over the plate but he was ready to turn on the inside fastball so direct to the pitch absolutely blasted out of this ballpark Team or you're a middle of the pack team. Every ball club wants to be dominant.
So digging in, Willie Mays. Now a screamer into the outfield. De La Cruz flashes the leather on the run and catch. Giants down in order. And now the Marlins will have... And welcome back to the ballpark. Start of the fourth. Here's the center fielder, Willie Mays. And first offering is fouled off. You can talk metrics and all that stuff, but no matter what, I think Willie Mays is the greatest defensive center fielder the game's ever seen. Not one one. close with that one. And the count even one and one. And just to touch on Mays' defensive ability, there isn't a ball he couldn't get to or a throw he couldn't make. He was an artist out there in the outfield. Under it. Calls it in, and there's one away. One out, base is empty. Willie Mays, the next Willie giant to hit. Mays. Pulled down the line. This one hammered, but it's foul. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. One down, base is empty. That one, one almost one. got him. If you're the mound right now, you know you have to retire this hitter. If he gets on base, it could open up the floodgates for this offense to score some runs. Swing and a miss. And one the count and is count. one and two. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. And the pitch. Hard hit, left side. No play, that's an infield single. Well, as hot hitting continues, he's been getting great results lately. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Jorge Soler the right up at the plate. Jorge Soler. The pitch. Knocks it, misses, it's a strikeout. Well, he didn't get the call on the mound the pitch before. Felt like he should have had him look it, I think. But, you know, that's good composure right there. He found a way to come back with another good pitch to get him to swing and miss. Two outs. Ball, outside. Outside. And now three and one. Matt Chapman waits to bat for the Giants. Right yeah. through there for a strike. This guy at the dish Down excels four. in two strike counts. Got to be careful with him out there on the mound. Good plate take appearance there. Able to take the walk. Well, interesting. He went with the off speed and walked the hitter. Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. Got it. Good job at damage control right there. So up next, Willie Mays. One for three. Warning track, wall, and you can touch them all, baseball man. He'll touch them all. His second home run of the series, and they close the gap. It's 6-2. Chris, he's homered in back-to-back -back games now. Yep, seeing the ball well, and he's got his timing locked in. He's looking pretty dangerous at the dish right now. I'm sure there's a big grin on his face right now, Boog. He's probably had some of those that didn't stay fair, but off the bat, it looked like it was going to be foul. These players just want to keep it rolling right now. You win this series, you got another team coming in, and you want to do exactly the same. Maybe even push a little further. Why don't you just want to sweep? You know the fans are going to be behind this clock. They'll be playing really well. Thank mm -hmm. you.